Malia. Now, now. Not another step. What have you done to Malia? Oh, don't worry about her. I'm a pacifist at heart. I gave her a little something to put her to sleep. What do you hope to gain by this treachery? Oh, that's easy. I want you to stop ministering to Rosa and get out of my town. You want that title that badly? I'm a visionary. I'm going to turn this backwater burg into a thriving metropolis, like Clockbank. But that fool Rosa is too stuck in the past to see the future. Eventually, I started thinking. I could do a better job than her. I could change this town. You would pressure her now? When she's battling a mortal illness? It's for her own good. She should give the town to me and retire, so she can focus on recuperating. I've almost got her convinced, but you're going to ruin all my hard work. Don't make this harder than it needs to be. Leave, and I promise I'll send Malia home. Ugh. Blah, blah, blah. Could you shut up already? Let's get to the point. You want this busybody gone, right? There's an easier way to make her disappear. Hold on. What are you planning? Depends on what she values more. Her money or her life. Stop! I hired you to stand there and look menacing. Nothing more. If you walk out that door right now, I'll pretend like none of this ever happened. Mick! Mac! Yeah, yeah, boss? Little Miss Tough Girl here is on her way out of town. Show her the boot, and take her purse for the trouble. I'm coming, Malia. Now then! My turn. Ah. Axe attack. Now it begins. Here 
Here I come. I'll end. Oh dear. You're welcome. Watch 
I will never fall to the likes of you. Now then! Here you go! Never doubt it for a second. I can I'll end you. What boils? Soul gets you fed. I know no cure for evil. <laughs> this... This wasn't supposed to happen. It's not my place to judge you for your crimes. Examine your deeds and your heart. And if you find them wanting, become a better person. Tell Rosa what happened here. <laughs> Malia, are you all right? I am now. Thanks, Casty. Let's go home, shall we? Your mother must be worried. I cannot thank you enough for everything you have done for us, Casty. I need no thanks. 
I merely did what was right. Here, your medicine. You'll stay in bed and rest now, understood? Mother... Lily... Yes, my lady. I... thank you... for your loyalty... to House Glenville. Lady Rosa... don't leave us! Greg... Y yes I leave our town in your hands, yours and Malia's both. Listen to our people, care for them, and make our home a better place. I will, I promise. So you promise me we'll see it together. Thank you, Greg. Cas... T... Rosa... It looks like Rosa has something she wants to talk about. I should inquire and give her a chance. Do you think I'll last until my daughter's birthday? Be strong, Rosa. You want to live to see Malia follow in your footsteps, right? Mm. I do. But that is only what I want for her as head of my household. Hmm? What I really want for my child is for her to be happy. <laughs> when I admit it aloud like that, I find that I no longer care a fiddle about the succession. I just want to live long enough to celebrate her birthday one last time. Nothing more. Rosa.
thank you. It's thanks to your skill that I still draw breath. No, Rosa. It's not my skill that sustained you, but your own strength. Malia. I have a present for you. this to you, the brooch of joy. You're giving me your brooch? Happy birthday, my angel. Thank you, mother. I'll cherish it always. I promise you, I'll grow up to be a kind and just ruler, just like you. Don't worry about me, mother. to go so soon? I... I wanted to thank you for everything you did for my mother. I promise you, I'll continue to tend the garden. Those herbs will be used to heal all who need them. <laughs> I know you'll be a kind and just leader, Malia. Oh, I almost forgot to ask. How is Mr. Trousseau? Trousseau? He was such a nice man. It'd be lovely to see him again. Oh, don't tell me you forgot all about him too. <sighs> I've never heard that name before. I wonder who he could be. mother will be better in no time. She has me caring for her, after all. <laughs> You're right. I have to save her. I have to save her. I won't let Malia cry. I can't. I promised Yorna. But... Rosa's illness is incurable, and I've only just begun studying the healing arts. Damn it. Damn it. I'm worthless. Worthless! Huh? Who are you people? Heirs Apothecaries. We heard someone named Rosa was in need of healing. 
And it is our purpose to extend a helping hand to all those in need. 